Now, I got lucky, the first conference I ever spoke at was the internet marketing conference and I didn't know what, I just thought it was internet marketing like I was doing for Wine Library and I get there and then that was going on. I, was, I, I didn't even know that world existed. Yeah, me neither. When it, when it, yeah, the first, yeah. So I was like, this is wild. I'm like a CD's eight hundred dollars, like you know, and then and then that was wild. I was like, intr- I was actually, intr- I was like, what? But then I heard the first speaker, and I was like, this is. He didn't say a thing, uh, and it was all like my relationship with this. Per- I was like, oh my god, they're playing a pyramid scheme of people. Well, I'm friend, right? I'm friends with Ricky Magoo. Oh, and Ricky Magoo's friends with the gold maker, and the gold maker's friends with the seven figure superstar. I was like, what is this? Like WWF? Like it was crazy. And then I got very lucky. Actually, I've never said this before. What I got lucky about was I was sitting in the crowd. It was my first talk. I didn't know there was green rooms. Like, I just showed up. I was like, hello? Like, ludicrous. I just sat and I sat at a table and this guy stands up there and is a complete scam artist. Like, my street and immigrant radar was very easy. To, and plus, he was talking about marketing. That's what I knew. And then the four people at my table were like, I'm not gonna use this person's name. That's the best marketer in the world. Because he's tricking, because he's tricking everybody into the way. And I'm like, him? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, he, he's like, everybody knows that. And I'm like, no, they don't. Like, I'm like, he's never been on CNN. He hasn't been on the cover of Fast Company. Like, I don't think anybody's ever heard of him outside of this. What is this world? And then I spent some time with those four or five people, and I was like, ugh. Like, as I realized, every one of them was trying to figure out how to become them, and it was just one big scheme of that. Or, then the, re- the other four people were like, literally the most schlemiel business DNA I'd ever seen in my life. Yeah. Like, and I was like, okay, this is bad. I actually went to the organizer, and to the organizer's credit, which to this day I'm stunned, I walk up to him, I, got a, I had a check, this is a long time ago, like, you get checks. I took it and I said, look, I'm gonna have to give you this back, because if I say what I'm about to say up here, the last four speakers are gonna be in big trouble and it's gonna be weird. And to his credit, he goes, do it. And I went up there and fucking ripped, ha- I mean, everybody's like, didn't even know what the hell I was talking about. And, um, and that's how it all started.